we had the question regarding the savior complex in religions. What are your thoughts on that? The savior complex, you, the savior complex would be a person that would be uh, think they are the savior. I guess that's what the savior complex would be. What I think of that is uh, implants, electronic implants in past lives, between lives, uh, where the person is being messed with. Like Joe Blow, uh, let's say Joe Blow and about a thousand other soldiers, they lose the war and uh, physical form or after they die, they get caught up by the archon types, ETs, extraterrestrial. And the ETs in the non-physical realm can be physical humans or they can be reptilian or greys, just anything at all. Yeah. But they are implant they will implant populations of planets thousands at a time. And so they can implant everyone or a select a few hundred or a few thousand with the savior complex and basically hypnotize and program the guy to think he's the savior. And he can actually be a, uh, a mouthpiece for the dark forces Doing out a particular religion or philosophy that will get masses of people in the physical body, yeah. masses following a particular region, uh, religion, and he's running around being the savior, believing he's the savior, and it can it can be due to uh, electronic implants. I mean, just load it in. You, you know, you are the savior. You are the one. You are the chosen one. You are this. You are that. You're special. And then when he's born, these ETs can abduct them, or trigger memories, uh, feeling states, euphoria, or, you know, all these things that will make this guy, empower this guy to be that mouthpiece for a religion. And they'll, they'll run around and, and be that, that savior. And it's a savior complex. Yeah. That's my understanding. I'm not saying there aren't real people that are really honest, loving people. <clears throat> and they, they saved everybody. Duh, what do you call them? Savior. <laughs> so, but there's a lot to it. It gets very religious very fast, and religions get very uh, much into indoctrination and uh, manipulation, control of masses very fast. And they're often, if not always, connected with a, a, a higher agenda, an extraterrestrial or an extra dimensional agenda by very conscious, aware, aware beings that know what they're doing with religion. They're controlling the thoughts and beliefs of the masses.